Hey everyone, welcome back to another CardPoint tutorial. This time we're gonna look at the CardPoint virtual terminal in association with the ID Tech card reader that is USB compatible. So this is a notebook computer that we're gonna plug this into. We're gonna pull up the virtual terminal and we're gonna run a transaction to demonstrate how it works. Coming up. So you'll start by logging into your CardPoint account. This is not the app, this is just the desktop web hosted version. So once you've plugged the card reader in, you wanna come over to the mock credit card and see if there is a swipe entry field right here. And in this example, there's not. So what you need to do, if yours looks like this, is come over to the administration tab and come over to the virtual terminal sub tab and come down to this box right here and check to make sure that your virtual terminal is enabled to accept swiped transactions with this USB card reader. Make sure to save, and then you're ready to come back to the virtual terminal. And you should see a swipe or secure key button on the mock credit card in your virtual terminal, and that's what you need to have in order to process a transaction with the USB reader. So you'll go ahead and plug the USB reader into any USB port on the computer and it'll have a green light there to show you that it's active and ready to go. Now you have this swipe secure key that when you click, now you're ready to run a transaction and you simply take the card reader and the magnetic strip goes away from the light. You swipe, it'll retrieve track data, encrypt, and it'll populate everything, including the card number, and it will even tokenize that card so it doesn't even show up on the screen. The only thing you need to populate is the dollar amount of the transaction, and we'll just run this transaction for a quarter, and you can process transaction, and there you go. So you can see that this is a captured transaction, and if, if you scroll down, it'll show you that you had an entry method of swiped with the USB card reader. This is a special USB card reader that's configured to work with the CardPoint virtual terminal. So if you have a MagTech or another device that's out there on the market, it may not work. So just be sure to get the ID Tech USB card reader directly from Card Connect, and I'll post the link in the description so you can do that. If you're new to CardPoint and the CardPoint Virtual Terminal and haven't yet seen the tutorial on how to run a transaction and store customer profiles in the secure vault, be sure to check out that video and again I'll post a link in the description. For more CardPoint tutorials, merchant account trainings, and payment tutorials as well as how to use CardPoint in your payment collection workflow, be sure to click on the subscribe button so you receive notifications when future videos are posted. Like this video, share it with your friends, and comment below if you have questions. I'm Brian Manning, and thanks for watching.